Okay, it's Atlanta's number one hip hop station, Hot 1079, and home for the Ricky Smiley Morning Show. Well, of course, you know it's your fault, B High Radio Shout In. Stepping in the building, I got a super producer in this thing. Drummer boy, what's good with it, my dog? Hey, yeah, boy, you already know it, man. On this promo, man. I mean, you got another banger out here tearing up the streets as we speak that we popping. NBA young boy featuring Bird, man. I mean, talk to me about that joint, boy. Man, it's crazy, man. I was just talking about NBA young boy, man, just how he have his have his vision. You know what I mean? He got this energy, you know what I'm saying? Remind me of Wap. Mm. And, and just, you know what I'm saying, just just coming in there and painting the picture. And, you know what I'm saying, not not afraid to take, you know, just just a little insight as well. Like, what you think, big bro? Let's do, woo, 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 you know what I mean? Yeah. And we just went in, and he uh, uh, uh put the verse down for Birdman. Birdman went in there, bam, killed it. it. It's just crazy, man, to see, you know what I mean, the energy and, you know what I'm saying, how the crowd, the people, you know what I'm saying, just, just in tune with the pain, the connection, the struggle, exactly. you know what I mean, and then how we uplifting and going to a whole nother world. Now we making bigger summertime anthems. You know what I mean? And we popping it. You know what I'm saying? We made it out. We made it. Exactly. Now, I mean, I know that that uh, song is doing numbers too, though, man. Oh, yeah. 35 million on YouTube, man. Yeah. It's, it's crazy, man. Until Death Call My Name was the album. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? If you ain't heard it, you ain't got it, go get it. You know what I'm saying? NBA Young Boy featuring Bird, man. We popping to get it. I can definitely dig that. Now, I mean, this new joint, though, man, because see, you, lace, you lace me with a few new bangers, though, drummer. Yeah. Where you were putting it on the line, man. See, that's produced by Drummer Boy. Then yeah. we got that D-Boy Fresh. You know what I'm saying? We got that Drummer Boy for you. We got that Drummer Boy Fresh for you Talk as to well. You. you know what I mean? So uh, definitely, you know, a lot of people been hearing about me losing my brother. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And I, I, I basically addressed the situation with this record. We're doing the album Live On. Mm -hmm. uh, we also got the cryptocurrency anthem XYO that I brought with me. You know what I'm saying? We just made black enterprise, you know what I'm saying? So we just teaching young men how to flip this money, put a little money here, and invest. You know what That's I'm saying? That's cold. That's um, cold. So absolutely. Just, man, education, a little uh, a, a little turn up, you know, mixed with a little mature rap, just on some whole different, you feel me? Exactly. Now, I mean, with that live on, man, you know, it was crazy what happened to bro, man. Talk to me about how that affected you, man. Um, I mean, it it, it brought so many relationships together and so many people reached out to me who was in tune with him and friends with him or mobbed with him or you know protégés under him or you know just you know seeing the family way the way they embraced each other you know what i mean and his his kids he got four kids three grandbabies and seeing how they handle it and how they coming together and of course you know i stood up and and, and took that position man my brother's keeper so it's a blessing to be able to uh deliver this project you know what i mean and continue his legacy through his kids and his family, and the record drops. Actually, uh, uh, it dropped uh, August second mm -hmm. on his son's birthday. Ooh. So it's just ironic, you know what I mean? Um, just, 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 just that itself, like him being able to live on yeah. through his son. Now this X Y O man, the cryptocurrency anthem. Break that down to me, man. And what you know about that crypto fool? Man, come on, man. I've been watching Bitcoin. I've been seeing a, a lot of people, you know, uh, turn their investment. You know what I'm saying? You see 50, what he's done with Bitcoin and a lot of different people. Uh, this particular coin, XYO, is the actual first sponsor for NASCAR. Mm. So seeing them spend those millions and that max amount of dollars, um, I mean, Dan Brazarian, some of the uh, Star Wars uh, owners and, and real top tier, Fortune 500 people are behind this coin, so I feel like it's one of the biggest situations. They actually paid me 40000 just to do an uh, anthem. Mm. You know what I mean? So it's, it's it's just like I'm on Worldstar. Me and Q, we did a company, Worldstar Music, R.I.P. Q. Yeah. Um, and we had Worldstar Music coming where I was putting all of these different independent artists and uh, uh, upcoming artists on the platform. You know what I mean? So this particular situation, you never know what you can do even on – you know, some people call them jingles. Some people call them anthems. In my form, we make them anthems, you know what I mean? And we put it into a song, into a record format that move the people, still allow you to dance, turn up, but educate you at the same time. Everything I do, I'm going to hit you with a message. That's right. Now, I mean, break down this whole D-Boy Fresh, man. Who is this guy? Drummer Boy Fresh. It's, it's really like the alter ego, but it's the it's the verbal side of me. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Through Drummer Boy, you're going to hear music. You're going to hear beats. If I told you an album through Drummer Boy, you're just going to imagine what I'm saying to you. But me actually speaking to you, you interviewing D-Boy Fresh, you getting verbal, you know what I mean, answers that give you a better insight on, 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 on my character, on my spirit, on my 
on, on, on who I am as a person. You know what I mean? So it's like a whole different extension yeah. to who I am. You know what I mean? What is it like for you, man, when you are already a cold-blooded producer and you're like, oh, man, I get to give this to myself? I mean, it's, it's, it's dope. It's just like Travis Scott or Kanye West or, yeah. you know, Dr. Dre, Swiss Beats, um, Manny Fresh, Jazzy Faye, all your top producers, man, that you know them through rapping or singing or being verbal or hitting you with some kind of melody and, and being, you know, uh, in front of the camera as well as behind the camera on some Spike Lee or, you know, uh, Tarantino, or, you know what I'm saying, all the greats, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? And it, it takes that it takes that discipline. To be able to know, you know what I mean, when and, and when not to, to, to you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So we just having fun, man, you know what I'm saying, and delivering messages, man. Follow me at Drummer Boy Fresh on the Instagram. Follow the uh, record label. We, we got the record label going crazy, man. Hits only. Drum Squad Records, you know what I mean? So uh, definitely come through, stop through the store mm -hmm. at House of Fresh ATL. We getting you freshed up. We keeping you clean. You know what I'm saying? That's right. And it's uh, it's just a blessing, man, to be able to touch people through fashion, touch people through music. You know what I mean? And you no, know, I was inspired by Diddy, of course. I'm inspired by Dre. I'm inspired by, you know what I mean? So many Quincy Jones. You know what I mean? And we got the the live band Drummer Boy Live uh, uh popping so. We working on new music. We got Matthew McQueen. We just did a Grey Goose anthem. We working mm. heavily with Grey Goose. Oh, uh, shout out to our team. Shout out to the Bacardi team. It's a blessing, man. We all over the place. I can dig it. Now, drummer, I done seen you all over the globe, man. Campaign, and I mean, talk to me about this campaign that you got going so strong right now, man. Hey, man, state to state, state to state, man. It's uh my birthday coming up August 11th, okay. so you know uh. Throughout the whole season, Leo's, man, I'm always getting booked, you know what I'm saying, going crazy. We just, we mobbed through New York uh, a couple of days back, you know what I'm saying, and, um, you know what I'm saying, we it, it just mobbing through all of the uh, the, the label situation, the, the, the fashion situation, we going through the singles and whatnot, man, we just touching the people, we doing donors, I'm sitting down with the blog, the media, the influencers, uh, we copping for the storehouse of Fresh ATL, and definitely um, just, you know, Really showing a lot of, lot of, lot of, lot of people that you can do a lot of things independently. You know what I'm saying? With the ground and the footwork. You know what I mean? Now I saw you mobbing through New York with a uh, whole live orchestra in this thing, man. Oh uh, yeah, absolutely, Break that man. down to me, man. Shout out, to the video. Yeah. Uh, last word, PR. You know what I'm saying? And, and um, just giving me the opportunity to work with uh, a great group of musicians. You know what I mean? And just kind of diversify. You know what I do how I do it, how we conduct, uh, doing the whole conductor thing as well as Drummer Boy Live, uh, writing sheet music and really taking music to the next level with this Trap Symphony. You know, a lot of people know me from, you know, the OG of Trap and starting so many different things from Trap with Standing Ovation, Jeezy, and working with Tip and working with Gucci. Uh, coming from Memphis, me and Yo Gotti, like just, just painting that picture from so early on throughout the inevitable entertainment days, you know what I'm saying, from the Life album to back to the basics, you know what I mean, and so on and so forth, uh, all the way up to the CMG days, you know, working hand-in-hand, -hand, bringing Money Bag Yo out, Young Dolph, um, um, you know, and, and, and you know, now we curating playlists with Audio Mac, yeah. you know what I mean, and, and uh, we just dropped a mixtape called Hometown Heroes with all the next up-and-coming Memphis artists. So, you know, I'm really just connecting the dots, you know, and, and taking myself to an executive mogul type, you know what I mean? Slash, 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 <laughs> like, you know what I mean? We just getting it done, man. I hate the, I hate the title drop. We just get it done. Now, when you think about Memphis, man, Memphis is on fire right now. It's been a minute since Memphis been being like that, okay? Yeah. Talk to me about that whole movement and how you feel about it. I mean, it's, it's, it's overdue, you know what I mean? And it's, you know, the youth, the generations after generations, man, so hungry, you know what I mean? And they've seen such a great group of individuals before them, you know, do it and make it out and, and, and get this money, you know what I mean? And I think uh, Gotti, you know, is a, is a, is a, is a great example of it's, it's possible. You know, I think Young Dolph is a great example of it's possible. These are guys who I've been putting on Welcome to My City Volume 1, Welcome to My City Volume 2, Welcome to My City Volume 3, and enlightening the world on what we got to offer in Memphis. And now you're seeing, you know, that repli replicate. You know what I'm saying? You're seeing that, that like, multiply. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, you know, it, it's just it's just a blessing to see, like, so many people, 
you know, uh, appreciate the culture and give thanks to that Memphis sound. You know, Juicy J, 3-6 Mafia, uh, Ball and G, some of the legendary artists uh, to really, you know, uh, put that staple down mm -hmm. coming from the M. So now it's, it's a blessing to be able to produce all these acts, unify these acts. You know, I work with Gucci and Jeezy during the beefs. You know what I'm saying? I work with Shouty Low and Tip during the beefs. You know what I mean? And I'm, I'm working through with Gotti and Dolph, you know what I mean, through the beefs and hopefully just trying to diffuse uh, the situation and, and, and reconnect, you know what I'm saying, the city because we more powerful together exactly. than we all find each other, man. And, and they all know that. We all know that. So we got to con consistently speak that, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? And they say speak it into the universe, it'll manifest, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So uh, we doing our job, man. Here's only. Now, drummer boy Fresh, how long had you been holding that guy back, man? Uh, man, it's crazy. Like, I've I, I been with it, but it, it just takes certain things to kind of, like, bring that monster out of you. I think I, I've been so focused on other artists. You know, I'm I'm a therapist. You know what I mean? I'm a life changer. You know what I mean? And it's a lot of artists out here that I've blessed, that I've put in position. You know, I remember a lot of these guys sleeping on my couch. and You know what I mean? Like, it's crazy because, you know, I'm working on my album now. I'm working on the Hits Only album. Mm -hmm. Similar to like a, t a DJ Khaled. Mm. And um, when you wait for like a year, I hit you for a verse. I'm hitting all my homies who I produce for all these hits. I'm hitting homies for verses. And it's like, you know, year go by. My nigga, what's up, bro? I'm, I'm just following up again. <laughs> like, yeah. Yeah, you know, I'm putting the project out. You know what I'm saying? Let me, what you, you know what I mean? And it's like, you can only wait so long when two years go, this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy. I, I really ain't got. Verses from, you know what I'm saying, a lot of my guy guys, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So I'm like, okay, well, I'm going to just put a verse on it myself, you know what I mean? I'm going a, I'm to a, I'm a drop this, so I'm going to do this this way, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And, you know, it, it, it it's, it's starting to work. It's starting to catch, you feel me? So, you know, here we are. Hits only. What do we need to be expecting from this project, man? Um, Man, really just some enlightenment, you know what I'm saying? All the top producers that you've ever seen. In the game, they all rap, they all verbal, they all give you some kind of form of a, a story, a message, you know what I mean? And, you know, me, I'm, I'm more like a mature type rap, you know what I mean? It's going to be a message mm -hmm. hidden off in that thing that you're going to have to, you know, and decode, you feel me? So, <laughs> you know, um, it, it's a blessing, man. When you have the platform, why not touch the people in every way, form, and fashion that you can? How important is it to you that you provide the listeners with a message, man? Because, I mean, that's one of the beautiful things about hip-hop and music in general is that when you can listen to music that gets you through, you see what I'm saying? It's one thing to, you know, bob your head and, you know, pump your fist. But when I'm going through some things, I need somebody that's going to relate to me riding shotgun with me through them woofers. Absolutely. And that, that was the whole point of me making the live on record, like losing my brother. Uh, sharing with the world uh, the emotions that I was going through at that particular time, mm -hmm. and absolute and and at the same time touching those emotions of the people who have lost one as well, mm -hmm. you know, or you still grieving, or you for trying to find a way uh, to make it through this this dark time in your life, you know what I mean? So for me and my mom as well, the family as well, we all turned it into a celebration of life, mm -hmm. and we celebrated his life, you know what I mean, and, and we encouraged uh the the kids to to live on and you know we knew that that he would live on through them that's right lastly drummer anything else you want to get off your chest and how can folks contact you my dog man definitely check out the xyo record live on uh, spotify itunes all music platforms uh again man black enterprise you know us as a people um it, it's platforms here that we can really turn you know a few dollars into some major investments you know what i mean and now we doing like rocco man shout out to rocco for starting yeah, a new rock. neighborhood man yeah. i see you man by <laughs> building that new division man yes, you know sir. definitely getting into construction and mm -hmm. uh, uh uh building up these neighborhoods and, uh, and taking ownership in some of this land mm -hmm. you know what i mean so we definitely focus on the transition man follow me on the instagram at drummer boy fresh d-r-u-double-m-a-b-o-y fresh uh check out the new website drummerboy.com and man Go get the music, man. We popping. NBA Young Boy. 1,000. Drama. Already. My dog. Appreciate you coming through this thing, boy. I wish you nothing but the best and much success. Already. BI Radio Shout It. It's Hot 107.9, man. Let's go. Hey, yeah.